Welcome to another Flexi Tool sewing video. My name is Graham and today I'm going to show you how to thread the top thread. Firstly, find the thread hole on the needle arm. This is the first hole where you will insert the thread. Push the thread through. Give yourself enough slack to work with. Place the thread inside the wire guides and then pull it up between the tensioner plates. Pull it up firmly so that the plates engage and the tension is on the threads. If your machine has a second thread tensioner then you can thread it in exactly the same way. Then take the thread through to the little coil thread track insert it through that as per the inset, pull it through and take it up towards the needle arm. You then take the thread up between the big arm and the little arm with the eye. Pass the thread through the eye of the little arm. Carefully take the thread in your fingers and pull through at the same time with your other hand you can give yourself some slack so that you have sufficient thread to work with to take the thread down to where the needle is. To do this you, you're going to use a small hooked tool which will grab the thread up the top and to do this you push that little tool up through where the needle is attached. You see there's a hole there. That will go up to the top as you can see it sits up there then what you can do is you hook the thread with the little hook on the end of that little tool and this will allow you to be able to pull your thread down through that barrel so that you can thread your needle. And you just do this carefully so that you don't s shred the thread and you'll see that the thread will appear at the bottom and you are now set up to thread the needle. Threading the needle is always done from left to right when you are on the side of the crank. It's very important that you thread the machine in this way. The machine will not stitch properly if it is threaded from right to left. So remember, left to right always. Then you can lift your walking foot and take the thread tail through and you will have threaded the machine and it is ready to sew. That brings us to the end of our video. Thank you for watching and please check out the other videos that I've made in this series.